I'm going to see how much it costs to have this tuk-tuk. Normally, another guy said to me, 100 for an hour. So we'll see. How much is it charging you? What did they charge? 100. For one hour? 150 or 100? Oh, it's two of you though, isn't it? charge? Ah, oh, one hour. How much, yeah? Ah, uh, one hour, I charge you 100 baht for one hour. 100. Where do you go? Ah, uh, Chinatown. Mm. Chinatown, in, inside Chinatown. Inside Bangkok. I show you. Outside uh, Bangkok. Inside Bangkok, uh, no help. Outside Bangkok. How far is the floating market? Ah, uh, floating market, ah, uh, go 50. 50 minutes. 50 minutes. Ah, 50 minutes. Come back 50 minutes. Go back, not one way. So how much there? Ah, uh, and back, and back. Uh, 800. Okay, for you, for 800. you. 800. 800. How far is that? Ah, uh, 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 on the way here, yeah, on the way. Voting market on the way. No, here. The yeah, 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 yeah. On uh, the way. Uh, uh, on the way. Where is the, flo the floating market? One second. For the floating market. So the floating market is uh, by car, not by yeah, tuk-tuk. Yeah, yeah, car, 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 car. And tuk-tuk is one hour. Uh, oh, not, not, not. Too far for this. Two hours. <laughs> Two hours. For, no, just driving around for one hour. Yeah, okay. How much? How much? I, Same price. I, what, 35 baht? Okay, 200 baht. No, that's too much. That's too much. 150, okay. I thought it was, what, 31 dollar. Now it's 150? Okay, 1 dollar. <laughs> no, I don't want to rip you off. One dollar, okay. One dollar is too cheap. Okay. For one hour, for one hour, how much is one for one hour? One, one dollar is too cheap. Huh? 20, 20 baht. Peninsula Pier. No, that's not. That's bad. Okay, I think, sorry. You don't want to take it? You couldn't go with me. Can we have here? No, 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 no. Why? I don't know. I'll show you. <laughs> so for one hour? Yeah. For one hour? One one hour, I for me one stop looking my sponsor. One what? One one for me one sponsor stop looking. I don't. For, for the shop, only looking. Oh, I don't know. No, I don't. I, I I don't want shop. I just want no. to you drive and you can show me something interesting I for know. my for no, my camera. No buy, no buy. Only looking at the shop. Give me the sponsor free gasoline. Who gives you free gasoline? Yeah, my sponsor. Oh, your sponsor gives you yeah, free gasoline? Yeah, only looking. Oh, so I go to the yeah, place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see. So that's why it's one dollar. Yeah. I go the, look. For the shop, give me the sponsor gasoline. Even if I don't buy? You buy, don't buy, don't buy. You, you still get money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. For me, for me. I'll okay. do it for you. Okay. So, but otherwise, how much I pay you? 30. 30 baht? You, ha you happy, you keep more. <laughs> okay. Let me, let me just... I'm looking at your exhaust. Welcome, welcome. Okay. I, I, you didn't send me, I had a sponsor. You only look it. Okay, I, we go, I only yeah. look. Uh, yeah. Maybe, what What do they have? I have the sponsor, the, the, the shop. Copy what? The tailor shop. Only looking, no buy. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. But now, I, I'll let the bit, huh? Yeah, you, I let you drive. Yeah. And then you take me to your sponsor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe I buy, you never know if it's something good. Yes. Maybe. Yes. Thank you very much, my boy. Okay, let's go. Uh, Alright, so here we go. Okay, you okay, okay. So I ended up actually spending six hours uh, with this tuk tuk driver. So the deal is basically he drives me around, takes me to these um, shops which um, he gets commission from. So every time he brings in a customer, whether or not they buy or not, he still gets uh, something. I don't know exactly what they get, but he gets uh, money or they pay for his fuel. Uh, before we went anywhere, he took me around just about anywhere where I wanted to go. He did ask me uh, where I wanted to go. I said, just take me anywhere. And he took me to the Lion Buddha, the Golden Mount, various other temples and... I don't, I just want to, you can drive anywhere. Chinatown, uh, a little bit? Yeah, Chinatown, yeah. Uh, Chinatown, a yeah. little bit? Just drive down Chinatown, yeah, then, yeah. yeah, anywhere you want. Yeah. I'm. But now, you have look for one sponsor. Okay. And then I'll allow Chinatown. Okay, let's go. The good the tailor shop. Okay, okay, we we'll go to the tailor shop. This 
is the first place I went to. The sales people at the stores are quite high pressure. They do try and make you order the suit straight away. They said they will make the suit because I said, oh, I'm leaving tomorrow. They said, yep, don't, don't worry. We can have it ready made uh, and uh, you can pick it up tomorrow before you leave. So how long does it take to make? So it's ready for you tomorrow evening. Great. Thanks very much, Chris. I'll see you later. Thanks. Nice stuff. Expensive, though. Oh, okay. This is the second one. So each each time I went to a new store, they were getting better and better and better. So this one was a little bit better than theirs. And this was the, the third and the last one. This was the best. Um, they had the most choice in material and they had other things. So a suit will cost you around about £120. A shirt, about £30. But though if you make two, three other um, suits, then they will, they will discount it even more, which is not too bad for a, a custom-made suit and a shirt. I think that's quite reasonable. Thank you. Thank you. Same price Same as price. as the other one. Yeah. Good suit, so good. Good. This, the suit, the material here is better. This one is better. Yeah. After the tailors, uh, he took me around some other places, uh, places where you can have something to eat. So they know, again, the same thing with the restaurants. They'll get a commission from every, every time they bring somebody to have something to eat there. Um, if, you, uh, if you know what you're getting uh, from the beginning, so you don't feel ripped off, because a lot of these people, um, they don't tell you that I get commission from this restaurant, this shop or whatever else. Um, but this guy was very open and um, he, he didn't hide anything. He said, look, I'm going to get paid for this and that. So I'm like, hey, I want something to eat. I don't care. Uh, he, as we were driving around, he was pointing out all the, the famous uh, spots. I've been to Thailand before, so I knew uh, where everything was before and I've seen before. But if it's your first time, I think it's a fantastic way of getting around the city. Uh, and it ended up costing me nothing. Um, I didn't pay him anything because at the beginning we, he said, oh, just pay me a dollar because he's getting money from the commission anyway. But um, in the end, um, we, we parted. Um, he actually uh, took me to some other places. We went to look at some uh, fake watches, some fake bags and so forth. I couldn't film there for obvious reasons. But yeah, really nice guy, uh, very friendly. And um, it was a great way to spend an afternoon. So. Uh, if you're going to Bangkok, I think definitely be upfront with the guy and say, look, if you're going to take me here, there and everywhere, how much are you going to charge me? And then if you just say, so look, I'll, I'll, you're going to get commission from these places. You could still pay them 100 baht. An hour's would be 100 baht. So I got six hours for free. Um, so he got his money and um, I got a whole afternoon's worth of tuk-tuk uh, uh, ride. But really enjoyable day. I would recommend doing it this way. Uh, so just be a bit careful if you are going to hire a tuk-tuk, don't pay more than 100 baht for an hour. If there's a couple of you, they might do a little, they might charge you a bit more, but um, I would say 100 per person is reasonable.